Hello, good day family. Today we have Mercedes GLA 250 2017 transmission adaptation. So let me take you through. Let me go to transmission. Already I have selected my this thing already. So I was doing this a quick thing for you. You read the two-foot code. Um, it has adaptation problem. The other shop, um, when the car came, they tried to do adaptation. So they changed the gearbox, thinking the problem will be solved. Then the four pieces. So let's go and check what we can do. So um, we will do the adaptation, but let me show you something. Um, when you shift the um, column, when you shift the reverse, it's supposed to go to reverse, but it's stuck on neutral, which means um, it has an adaptation faulty. The pack power has been locked. Um, since they decided to they try to do the distance adaptation so we try to do the teaching you go to normalize and then you normalize it um, uh, what happened was that um, uh, we, 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 would, we are doing full basic adaptation so we click the F1 the F1 to take us through um, Click continue. You read the precaution, then you click continue. Your car is supposed to meet all these conditions before it can be, you know, the adaptation can be work or it can be successful. So you click yes, then you continue. Here we have to start the car. And we, we, we have to make sure our RPM is supposed to be 200, 2000, uh, 2000 to 4000. We click continue, and then it will take us to the next steps. So, what happens is that um, they have changed the, uh, the gearbox. The old gearbox was having the same issue, but instead of them to check the, check the, um, the gearbox or check what has happened they decided to do adaptation so the adaptation couldn't be successful and they take the gearbox out and you know um, fix a new gearbox I did the coding I did the programming I read out the entire data uh, my previous video I'll show you the VGS 2 and VGS 3 uh, VGS and VGS 2 stuff so uh, this is it we close the door and we press our brake fully we press the brake fully so we press them it will continue automatically so as i was saying um when these sessions come uh, you will hear a whole lot of sound um, the, just ignore the fault just ignore it but you will hear sounds the pack power um, the, the, the pressure pressure pump everything will be working so you'll be hearing noise from the transmission it is normal it is normal so you shouldn't be worried about those stuff it's normal but as i was saying now uh, earlier on now um, they changed the transmission because of the adaptation was in the old gearbox when we transfer the data onto the new uh, gearbox the fault was in so it couldn't you couldn't shift the gear to the to reverse or right so i went there to do the adaptation for them so i decided to make a short video so that you all will learn from it so it's in progress the f will keep flashing simply because the system is communicating now our music is communicating with the transmission system and station is still running and everything is going on remember we are doing full basic adaptation in other situation you will find only pack power 40 
anytime you find Park Park 40, um, when you go to the adaptation, the only thing you do is that you um, do adaptation only on the Park Park. Uh, our foot is still on the break. Uh, I'm just showing you to make you know that our um, foot. So we turn the ignition off. The first procedure is done, so we turn our ignition off. Then we switch it on again. Click OK. As you can see, the adaptation is successful. It's successful. So what we do is that um, we will go back, and then we read the fault and see whether the adaptation still persists or not. Bam, bingo. No fault code. That means our system um, has been adapted successfully we go to um, okay we will come back on these things and see the general fault and the general values and everything so as you can see it shifts to the drive and reverse and everything is working perfect turn on start again reverse drive as you can see it's working perfectly so um that is it okay let me let me take you to the live data and check um, and let's see the engagement um oh no general values so no general values so let me hit back we go to our position sensor um, so that we, we will see whether as you can see the pack power is engaged see over there is already engaged actual gear is in reverse because i have started it that is drive so it's in neutral position now which is park it's, everything is working perfectly so the job is done and that is how Yeah, we hear me. I'll take you in. I'll take you in. I'll take you in. I'll take you in.